Hey friends, welcome, 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 welcome back to the channel, welcome back to being Samu. If you are new here, please do like this video and comment which items stood out for you in the comment section. And I hope that by the end of this video, it would have convinced you to subscribe. <laughs> If you're an older but a goodie, welcome back, my love. Welcome back to your favorite channel. So today we're doing a rate my stock with me. This is this is the basket thumbnail moment. Literally, this is a massive, massive rate my stock with me. We will count how many dresses we have here. I am not sure. I didn't count. And I just want to do a rating with you guys on this channel for just something light to watch. So, yeah. I hope that you'll enjoy this video. And if you do, please give it a huge, huge thumbs up. Let's get this video rolling. <laughs> dress that we are rating is this black and white dress it is fully white with some black stitching i would definitely rate this a nine out of ten nine out of ten mainly because i see some staining on it but it feels like a really nice dress and the skirt is lined it has a side zip and this is what the back looks like it has a bit of um, dirt. It needs to be washed. But I think it's a really cute dress with a little strip, with a little slit over here. The second dress is this one, which I would rate a 10 out of 10 or a 9 out of 10. Or a 10 out of 10, mainly because I am a fan of size inclusive dresses and this looks like it's a size 36 it has some dirt on it but it looks like the kind that um like collateral damage the kind that you it only got onto the dress because of transportation and moving around and all of that i really like this it's a baby doll with some buttons in the front functional pockets and this trims that just make it a bit elegant and just adding a pop of black onto the dress. And then we're going into the black and white dresses. I really like this dress mainly because of the material it's made from. It's very thick material giving that this dress is definitely, definitely a winter dress. It has these cute buckles over here which are functional but this part doesn't open up it has a sailor collar and this is what the back looks like i would rate this one a 10 out of 10. we have another black and white dress with some color detailing and a bit of um wording here written you i think this is a cute dress i would rate it a 10 out of 10 it just has a bit of dust over here which is nothing to worry about because these are still going into the wash it has no imperfections really good good quality dress up next is this shirt it's basically a shirt because it doesn't button all the way down it has three buttons on the bust and a bit on the stomach area I think this is also a size 36 or a 38 if I'm not mistaken. It has a plain back. Really, really something really cute. This you can put on with your, what are these, your wide leg, white pants. It would really bang. I would rate this a 10 out of 10 regardless of the broken button. Up next is this stripy black and white t-shirt dress. I would rate this one a 7 out of 10, mainly because it's showing signs of aging. 
the color is fading off it used to have some drawstrings here which are not there anymore and it has a few stains all over it which do not look like they will be washable so i'm rating this one a 7 out of 10 mainly because it does look worn and it has stains and it's missing the drawstring i am going to start with the black and white dresses because i took them out so i can create content up next is this very very cute baby doll dress it's a mock two in one so it's a dress that's supposed to be um worn with a what's this a waistcoat so yeah it's a two in one i really really like this i wished it was in my size but it's cute i would rate this a nine out of ten mainly because um the color on it is fading off so it would definitely be a 10 out of 10 if the color was not fading off up next is this simple dress with an elasticated waist and some pockets um it also has some slits on the side this one i would rate a 9 out of 10 because it has some bleach staining on it but it's a really cute dress it's just that it's stained at the bottom even on the sleeves all over the dress so this one i would rate a 9 out of 10 up next is this simple t-shirt dress with some side pockets it's really just a simple simple shirt dress and it looks like this at the back i would rate this one a 9 out of 10 also mainly because the color is fading Here's a maxi black dress with some nice detailing over here. I really like this. But I would rate it a 9 out of 10. It has some fraying over here. I think maybe the previous owner was wearing it and they scratched it. Um, I don't know with what. Maybe they... Um, touched it with unfinished wood that might have scratched the material and this is what the back looks like i am really bummed over this area over here because it this would have been a lovely lovely dress honestly but it is what it is and it's a simple button down dress which i think needs the other buttons need need to be changed because they are not matching and i don't really like the pattern of buttons they've chosen when i change these buttons i am going to change them into maybe a green color just so that it um it matches with the colors on the dress but it's a simple button down silk dress with an elasticated waist at the back we have this checked checked button down dress it feels like it's made from linen this is what the back looks like the waist is elasticated i would rate this a 10 out of 10 regardless of the fact that the material looks like it's a bit fading off but it's giving to it gives oh the the buttonhole is a bit damaged so i would give this a 9 out of 10 just because of the buttonhole then we have this baby doll dress it is so dirty um it has some oil like staining over here over here oh it is so dirty but the staining it seems like the staining is only in the front i think this is a cute dress that you can wear with some green accessories something really really cute it has functional buttons over here i would rate this one also a 9 out of 10 
mainly because of the staining and staining on a white item is very difficult to remove up next we have this baby doll dress i think this one was also supposed to come with some drawstrings that go through here it has functional pop functional buttons and it's just a simple dress nothing to write home about it is also a bit stained and will need attention while washing i would rate this one a 9 out of 10 we have another mock two in one dress um it's a simple dress with with some stains but they look removable so this is supposed to look like you're wearing a pinafore over a shirt and this is what the back looks like um simple dress i'm not sure about the color but i would rate this one a 10 out of 10 looking at the quality and yeah the material overall we have this what do we call this a bent orange bent orange or orange dress it is a button down dress with functional pockets on the bust and it feels like the material is cotton it is also pleated doesn't look like it has any it doesn't look like it has any stains i would rate this a 10 out of 10 then we have this guava number a simple maxi dress with some pleats and pockets unfortunately the material seems like the color is fading off and it has some staining at the back it is torn by the by the end of the zip it has also these two stains that i don't think will come off i would definitely definitely rate this a 7 out of 10 we have this navy this baby blue sailor dress i don't like these trims because really this blue doesn't match this blue and it's very 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 light in material it has a few stains but you see this stain i don't think it will even come off i would rate this one a 7 out of 10 mainly because of the stains the material and this detailing over here is not it up next is this navy button down dress i think this is cute it is very thick it's made from thick material this is what the back looks like i like that it has some ties to cinch in the waist it has a side zip for easy wearing and i like this color i like this one i would rate it a 10 out of 10 we then have this orange dress it's an orange tiered dress with a collar it has some oil like staining over here it has functional pockets and a waist tie i think it's cute i would rate this a 9 out of 10 mainly because of the staining up next is this checked black and green or oh, hound's tooth yeah i think it's a hound's tooth pattern dress with puff sleeves a bow and a collar i really like the make the design of this dress not so much the color but this is what the front looks like it has functional buttons this is what the back looks like and i would rate this one a 10 out of 10 this one is a dress that's supposed to look like the sleeves are on the shoulders and these straps are actually will be on the shoulders it has an elasticated waist some pockets really cute really cute dress i would rate this a 10 out of 10 and then we have this stripe white and blue dress of which i'm not sure why it has these huge buttons here 
and i was like to myself why did the owner put these buttons there but i've just realized now that even the button holes are big for these buttons so i think this is the whole design it has some waist ties a pleated skirt i think this is really cute and it would make like a nice um upcycle dessert but i'm not sure if i'll make it into a set because it's really size inclusive i think it is a size 36 with functional buttons i would rate this a 9 out of 10 mainly because i don't understand you know this is a baby doll dress printed i'm not a fan of printed dresses but i think this is a cute summer dress very very light and see-through it has a side zip functional buttons i would rate this a nine out of ten just because i don't like the style we have another colored dress polka dot with pockets something cute for the office this is what the bag looks like no staining very very clean dress i like it i would rate that one a 10 out of 10 even though i don't like the style but it's a clean dress no staining i like how it's made we then have this dress i think i like the detailing on this dress and how it ends here i'm just not sure how it went through quality check because of the old the oil staining that's on it it has a bit of stains uh, more stains than i would than i would like you see what's this this might come off but yo how was this missed i'll try and wash it but for now it's getting a eight out of ten we have this yellow button down dress with some functional buttons a belt loop and i like the material it's like a mock linen type of material i would rate this a 10 out of 10 because i like the color like i really really like a nice pop of color we have this pastel yellow dress that's giving um a two in one and i don't think my mom checked this dress is hey because the stains i'm seeing here like she wouldn't have missed the staining if she did check the dresses honestly like even you can tell there's like a huge stain on this dress but maybe she thought the dress was gonna be a maybe she thought the stain was going to come off so it has some cutouts here and the buttons are not functional this is what the back looks like it ties over here and yeah i would give this one an 8 out of 10 just because of how big that stain is i've been loving the color variety that comes with the dresses but the stains are yo oh. we have this black and white dress with some waist ties I think this is really cute functional buttons puff sleeves and this is what the back looks like you see this is you tie it you tie you tie this on the side like that and then you also tie on this side i would give this one a nine out of ten because it has this tiny stains that i'm not sure whether they'll come off we have another pastel yellow pastel yellow where does this go oh this is just a belt loop thing I'm not sure but it's strange can you tell it's a simple pastel yellow dress with this i'm not sure where this goes but it looks like it's supposed to be part of the belt loop situation it has some pockets 
and this is what the back looks like i would give this an seven out of ten just because i don't understand that thing over here and it has a bit of staining up next is this very bright lilac dress i like it it has some waist ties it ties on the waist so the waist can be a bit singed as you can see it is two stepped it is tiered it has this nice collar and this is what the back looks like it doesn't have any major stains so it's a 10 out of 10 10 out of 10 my darling we have this purple dress something cute but not it's not um something cute and unique yeah it's unique and it looks like it's made from silk material it also has this oil like staining i'm not sure what i should add on my on my washes on my circle on my wash circle on my wash cycle so that um i can easily remove the oil stains if you have any ideas please let me know or i should just go get a um a pre-wash the varnish has this spray that you use to spray on dresses and use it as a as like a stain removal thing works like a charm but it's so expensive but yeah this is the front of the dress this is the back of the dress and i would rate this a 9 out of 10 just because of the staining we then have this navy blue dress with some drama <laughs> it's a plain simple dress that has a lot of drama it's torn on the side but why did i get this why did i get this dress i really don't think these dresses were checked but it has a zip that zips down at the back i would rate this a six out of ten because it's just a simple um design it's a simple design with the uh, torn that's torn over here and you know i don't i don't do well with tears this i really like i really really like this one haven't checked it properly but i like i like the idea behind it and tada oh i like this dress i might keep this dress for myself y'all because honey look at this dress imagine me walking in and i'm wearing this dress i'm wearing like nice silver heels matching with a silver handbag very cute i like it it's an asim it's a shirt button down shirt dress it has some staining which i hope will come off because me and this darling are in love okay i would rate this a 9 out of 10 mainly because of the staining but style and uniqueness nailed down but we have this um casual gray dress it has these exaggerated colors and this is what the back looks like this i would definitely give a 10 out of 10 and it would have been an epic 11 out of 10 if these were navy if these were matching this navy you know and not black okay we have this floral dress really really cute a bit see-through but it's really cute it just has a, a yellow like curry like stain and those ones are not easy to come off you know i really like this doll like with a pop of green Ooh, this dress would be elevated i would rate this dress a 9 out of 10 mainly because of that stain we have a navy dress very unique the collar goes all the way down as this 
detailing thing and this is what the back looks like it's a bit sheer and it also has a zipper over here and this i would rate a 9 out of 10 yeah 9 out of 10 not 10 out of 10 because it's not something i would wear we then have this dress i don't like dresses that are in odd colors <laughs> what color is this honey but we have this button down dress with some pleating on the skirt and long sleeves this is what the back looks like i'm hungry i'm hoping one of my clients will like this one um i'd give it a nine out of ten and that one is just because of that color it would be a 10 out of 10 if it was in another color white or black or oh, yeah yo these dresses are so stained like one thing i'll tell you too stained this one also has those curry like stains it also has underarm staining yo it has some rust on top yeah this girl i'm not sure if she checked my dresses guys but we have this floral brown dress i would definitely give this one a 5 out of 10 mainly because it has rust like curry like stains that i am definitely sure they will not come off and she'll just give me troubles trying to sell her i will have to sell her at the price at which i bought her so five out of ten my darling this is a brown baby doll dress i think this is really cute hey like even the material it's giving suede like material no stains it has pockets functional buttons a plain bag i like her i'm gonna give her a 10 out of 10 this one is giving raincoat like vibes i don't know if you can tell from um the sound of the material it has a functional zip that doesn't go all the way and this is what the back looks like is this a dress or a jacket i give this a nine out of ten no stains nothing i'm just not too sure of the style then we have this pink dress simple pink dress with um cute sleeves and it has a zipper at the back and some light staining that i think can be washed off we can give her a nine out of ten we have this stripe white and blue dress with some nice exaggerated sleeve detailing over here and a collar that looks like is not a collar but it has a stain over here and i'm worried about that staining so this is what the back looks like i would rate this one a 9 out of 10 mainly because of the staining that we're not sure of have the sky blue baby button down with a button down with a nice collar it also has an oil like stain over there and then this is what the back looks like i like this dress i like this dress but it would be skimpy on me i would rate it a 9 out of 10 just because of the oil like stain it's been my favorite color of the season like i like this color it's a baby doll dress with do these go at the back are these waist ties with some waist ties and some ties over here that can help you make up a bow and even make this dress even cuter it has a stain over here that doesn't look like it will come off this is what the back looks like it also has some staining at the back 
I would give her an 8 out of 10 mainly because I like the color but the stains um shall and then we have this checked dress I think she's giving more winter dress checked dress button down um long sleeve cute 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 something you would wear with brown tights and brown boots with a blazer or a jacket I would rate her a 10 out of 10 no fault I like the material up next we have this red dress it is quite a big size it's a button-down dress with pockets I think it's around size 40 this is what the back looks like it has some staining but I think these stains will be able to come off and I'm rating this one a 10 out of 10 we have this one it's giving two in one and it has some staining on the collar even on the on the arm and i hope these will be able to come off this is what the back looks like also has some buttons i would rate this one a 9 out of 10 mainly because of the staining we have our second last dress which is a baby doll dress giving bohemian it, the material feels really nice it's like cotton material this is what the back looks like i really really like the material and how simple and straightforward this dress is i would give it a 9 out of 10 mainly because it's fading a bit and last but not least would i say this dress is my favorite out of them all i wish it fit me i wish this dress was my size guys i really wish this dress was my size but it looks like it's a size 34 great dress with some white trimmings and a white collar it has some staining on the on the white part and even has a bow at the back but the bow is also stained the collar is stained it has a side zip i really like this dress i am going to give it a 9 out of 10 mainly because of the staining and nothing else and that's it my sweeties i hope you have enjoyed this massive haul i will be i will be uploading all of these dresses at the end of march towards april but it is mainly my april stock i hope you have liked this video and that i will see you on my other videos goodbye